if this is your first time here, well, this is not your first time here, welcome. So, I was asked a viewer question yesterday. I just got through working out, so I decided to go ahead and tell Maddie. Shout out to Maddie. I hope you have an awesome day. I thank you for the question. I thank you for the encouragement, and I thank you for the comment. So, with that being said, you had that on my mind all day yesterday because really that's what I've been going through, trying to figure out what my passion is. But by you putting the question the way that you did, what was my biggest passion? That was God letting me know I'm not average. So I do have more than, like, I'm a passionate person. So I would do a mukbang, especially for you. If you see this, Maddie, before I do my mukbang this afternoon, maybe you can come in something simple for me to eat maybe your favorite dish and i'll cook it and eat it um even if i don't like it because i don't like spaghetti tomato sauce i don't like pizza if it's not white sauce pizza so i'll be a good sport if i can go get it today and i can afford it today i will do that for you answering your question but i truly thank you for it i'll let you know what my biggest passion is so now if you have a passion and if someone's told you, well, how you going to do that and you can do this? You may like one thing and then you may feel something else. But as you grow older, because we're made up of different emotions, and once we find out what we may be going through, it's in us to help other people. But sometimes we wouldn't raise like that and we get this thing Oh, that ain't got nothing to do with you. That ain't your business. That, your business. that was a spark of your passion right there to try to help somebody to feel better. You're not always questioning what's going on with somebody just because you want to be nosy and messy or whatever. And if that's you, we'll pray for you. Cool. That was just the way you were raised. And sometimes we have to get up out of there. I know people that's messing down and the grandkids going up that's messing down. But when they see the older people being messing down, they like, oh, that's how they act. That's because when you raise a certain way and you know nothing but that, that's how it sits off. So a lot of people may not know that they may be being messy. So back to the point was when we have a a feeling on the inside, when somebody may be crying, hurting, or getting abused or whatever to help, that's because that's the way we was created. And I was never taught to shut mine down. So this is me. So I just got through working out and I need to go take a shower and get ready for my morning. Go have my shake. I've already had some water, tea, my immune essentials, and some fiber. I'm about to jump in this tub that got some vinegar in it. And I will see y'all later. Love you much. Until then, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe.